What is up, everybody? This is Cody, a.k.a. DFS Prodigy, coming to you live to talk about the upcoming DraftKings NBA preseason slate for December 16th, 2020. So, so far, we're doing good. Uh, the showdown slate's looking really good for the Warriors. I'm watching the game currently right now, the Warriors and Kings, and like I said, it's doing quite well. Um, so far, NBA preseason has been not bad, not bad at all. Um, NBA is one of my favorite sports to play, just like UFC. And we're going to dig right into this NBA slate. But before we begin, hit that like button for me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It helps me know a ton, as y'all know. And hit that notification bell to know when we go live. Now let's dig right into it. We have the Cleveland Cavaliers and the New York Knicks. So we have Colin Sexton, questionable. We have Del Vadova out for Cleveland. Um, for this Cleveland team, I mean, Nance is out. Porter's questionable. Osmond's questionable. There's a lot of guys questionable. McGee, so on and so forth. So, if this remains true, which that's why we got to watch the news for the preseason, because it's a big, basically, edge in the preseason, is knowing who's out, just like with um, Miles Turner in that Pacer showdown. He was 30% owned in the big $10 tournament. So, watch the news. That's what's going to help you out on these slates for the preseason. Anyways... Andre Drummond should be able to smash that price tag if all these guys are out. He'll be the focal point in the offense. I'm liking him a ton, just like Darius Garland, who would be able to basically run the point with the two-way guard in Okora, the rookie. So that's where I'm basically looking at is Drummond, Garland, and Okora are the main guys I'm looking at. Dotson's a little iffy to me. I don't mind Dotson, but I'd rather get to Okora. Uh, that's what I'm looking at for the Cavaliers. Going on to the Knicks. The Knicks, J Julius Randle, lock and load him. He's definitely my number one guy on the slate. You would get a sneak peek in my core three on my website at dfsparty.wordpress.com. He's the number one guy I'm on. I love me some Julius Randle. Alfred Payton's minutes are going down, so be careful with him. Obi Topin is getting great minutes. So is R.J. Barrett. R.J. Barrett's definitely another guy I'm looking at. You can go to New Orleans, not well, or Mitchell Robertson, but they're just man plays to me. That's what I'm mainly looking at for this New York's team. So, Julius Randle, Andre Drummond, Okora, and R.J. Barrett are definitely the guys I'm looking at in that first game. Going to the Bulls and the OKC Thunder, you can go certainly to, on Chicago, Colby White and Zach Levine. Those are the two main guys I'm locking and loading into my line. I love me some Colby White and Zach Levine. Those two guys are running the, the offense for the Bulls. They're going to see the most minutes. They're both polishing the game. They looked well. I'm all over them. Thomas Sandoransky's out, so is Gary Tipple, so is Teddy Slint Young. So you can look to win a Carter Jr. He's actually shooting the three ball, so I wouldn't mind getting to him at all either. Other than that, that's what I'm looking at on the Bulls. Patrick Williams, I forgot about him, the rookie. He's okay. He's getting you 25 minutes or so, but just be careful with him. On the OKC side, just SGA. Literally, it's all I have to say is SGA. He's running this offense. He's the main guy on the team. He's the alpha on this team. He's the good. He's the definitely the dude. Other than that, all these guys are coming back, so the minutes are going to be scattered. Going over to Portland and Denver. Portland is not a team I'm really looking at a lot. Their minutes are weird. They're basically spreading all their players out, so you don't know what you're going to get out of them. So I'm not really on them at all. Their minutes are crazy, like I said, so it's just a man option to me. You can get to Giles or Cantor if you need a big man, but other than that, I'm not going to Nurkic. I'm not going to McCollum or Lillard, really. I'd rather pay up for some other guys. Going over to Denver, this is the team I will pay out for. I like me some Jokic. I like me some Murray. Those are the two guys I'm looking at. Michael Porter Jr. with Will Barton back is scary to me, so I'm not on him. Well, Murray, like I said, is a valuable, a viable option, not a valuable option, a viable option if you want to get to him. Other than that, it's just a mad team to me. I'm pretty much crossing this game off. Suns and the Lakers, let's talk about the Suns first. Devin Booker and DeAndre Ayton. That's all I have to say. DeAndre Ayton's smashed in the spots that he's got. Give me some DeAndre Ayton shares. He should be able to kill this Lakers team with Montrose Hill and Marcus Cole. I'm all over DeAndre Ayton. Devin Booker, you can get to him if you want to be a contrarian. Mikel Bridges is a male option to me. Chris Paul is a no-go. He's not playing more than 10 minutes. Javon Cotter disappointed last game. I'm not going and chasing his latest games. Let's move on to the Lakers. LeBron James and Anthony Davis are going to play only the, in the first half. You know, well, you won't see them in the second half. So I'm fading them based on that price tag. 
Get his shoulder. His usage rate will be low in the first half with LeBron James and Anthony Davis. You're looking for him in the second half. I don't mind him. Montrezl Harrell, he's in a good spot, but he is going against DeAndre Ayton, so be careful with him. THT, the hometown hero for the preseason slate. You can get to him if you want, but be careful. Other than that, that's where I'm kind of going. So, guys, that wraps up for me. This is basically the guys I'm liking to start off your lineup. I'm definitely getting to these guys. They're going to be all over my lineup no matter how many lineups I make. Again, hit the like button for me. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. It helps me in a ton, as you all know, and have a great and safe rest of your night. Have a good one, everybody.